Well, welcome back, guys, to DKM Farms. Uh, you join me here. Today is Veterans Day in the USA, so I want to give a big shout out to all the veterans and people serving in our country. Uh, it's because of your sacrifices, I am able to do what I'm doing now. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. I greatly appreciate it. If you all know a veteran or someone serving in the US Armed Forces, please give them a thank you because they sacrificed so much for our country. But, and just thank you from the bottom of my heart. From now on to the video. Now you can see it is snowing. Some things have changed. As you see, we no longer have our John Deere combine. That was a stupid investment to begin with, but we sold that and we now got our Coon PMR. This is what we need to uh, feed our cattle. In the top left hand corner, you're going to see it takes grass, silage, hay, and then mineral. Very little. These are these two. I bought two of them. We, I also bought a John Deere skid steer that I use in my other uh, playlist. I love this thing. A bear spear and a pallet fork. This is what we're going to. This is what we're going to need to feed the cows and the sheep and to get the farm turned around. We are still doing our harvesting job, and not only that, we are going to hop right on in here. We are going to find another job to do right now because we need to pay back $240,000. So let's hop right on in here. Um, here's a cultivating job, quick and easy. Ooh, and we get a huge, a big one. 21,000, filled 17. Let's borrow the equipment. Look at that. Woo! Those are some big pieces of equipment. Let's hook up to this. I'm gonna take it to the field and get all this stuff moved over to the farm and I'll meet you back then. Alrighty, folks, I am made it to the field I started harvesting uh, we we're gonna get this guy on a straight stretch and we are going to try to see how many cultivating jobs we can do because uh, honestly I think we can knock out three or four just see how many we can do to start making money so we can pay back that $240,000 loan. So let's set that off. Let's go over here. Right now, until I get some straw, which I don't feel like buying right now, because we're not in the financial situation, uh, figured out how the what the right ratio and stuff. I don't know if the cattle will take it all, but we will give it to them. check it after seems like they're taking it all
All right, I guess I did take it all. Let's get out here. Well, let's save it. Let's go check out the animals. So apparently they can take a lot more food. Um, which we got. That's no big deal. I'll work on feeding them. But let's go over here and let's, well, let's put this in here. Then let's take a grass bell to the sheep. Said the hundred percent on that, but we got one wolf, one thing of wool. I don't know if they're taking or not. Oh, they did. Let's pull this one back out. I like to check the sheet. Uh, let's give them one more bell. But guys, I will do that. I will feed them. And I will feed the cattle. But let's get... I'll take that care of that. Let's go in here. If there's any more cultivating jobs. Field 8. Let's do it. And we are going to start making some money. Let's see. But I will bring you all back in either when we get one field to get done or when we get done. Uh, feeding the cows folks we have gotten the sheep taken care of sheep are super easy grass and hay that's it cows on their hand a little bit more tricky to get out of the weather as you can see see perfect as for the cows i'm gonna have to do some more research uh their production's up 16 percent now they still do new straw. I do know that, um, but their health is up to twenty percent. Now, the way I raise cattle, yeah, it's black Angus. You give them hay, grass in the summer, hay in the winter. They're great, and some mineral in the summer and the winter too. Other than that, they're not that hard. So I'll have to do a little bit more configuration on this. As for this guy's still working, um, this guy might be uh, where is that? Oh, what's on sale? There is a sprayer. We do have the money. Ah, nah. Uh, Oh, where is it? I can't find it. There it is. We did complete it. So, boom. We made $17,000. Um, as I know, it's been a, a different style video than the ones I posted before. But tell me how you like it. Uh, tell me in the comment section below if you like it or if you want to see the fast forward of us harvesting. I did a lot of jumping back and forth and uh a lot of it was feeding uh getting the uh, cows fed and everything 
The skiss steer, I don't think is going to work on the farm. So that will be replaced. Just not currently right now. Need being because we need to pay down some of this line. Let's send this back to the field. Let's get back over here. Something that I do want to purchase before we pay off the loan. Um, we'll just do it right here. Let's go into constructions. Couple things I want to purchase. First of all, productions. I do want a greenhouse and I do want Um, I'm thinking about a couple of these. I just don't know where on the farm right now would be the best place for them. I'm thinking right here, something like one right there, one right here or in this general vicinity or this general vicinity, but I'm not 100% sure on that yet. I do know I want them, but I do want these generators. If you look, this uh, small wind turbine, 11,400, produced 984 a month. I do want that. Where, oh, where should we put it? It's going to be out of the way, out of the way of everybody. You could put one. Put one right here. One right here. One right here. Now you're probably thinking, why did you just spend that much money on wind turbines? This whole area, yes, it's pasture land, but they're not, the cows are never really over here. We actually have this whole side. They really never come past this. So like they're like an invisible fence here. So we have all this. I put it there because they're out of sight, out of mind. We'll never run into them. They produce nearly a thousand dollars a month so right there every month our farm will now be producing uh, three thousand dollars remaining let's go back and pay some on our loan oh. let's only pay now we Yes, we only pay $5,000, I get that, but remember, we are making $3,000 a month off of that now. Uh, let's see. This is the old cow barn said our cows health are up 30%, so maybe it goes up a little ever, but uh, we're go I'm gonna have to feed them more water. They got 537 liters of milk, which ain't a lot because their health, um, but the slurry, 25719 We could sell that. I don't know. Let's check it. I don't know what it goes for. Um, where's it at? There it is. Uh, slurry. 36. Well, when the bet, now's a bad time to sell it. So I guess. Well, it's December, so I guess we got till February to sell it, or next month. So we'll sell all our slurry next month, or we could hold off on it and sell it all next year. Um, well, let's sell it and see how we do. We'll do that next episode, guys. But that's going to be all for this episode, guys. If you like what you see here, hit that thumbs up button. And don't forget to share it and subscribe to the DKM Farm family. We love to have you. Until then, guys, I'll see you real soon.